Hey guys, so today I have a Goodwill haul and I have to very quickly show you these things because they want them back. Go get them from a pacifier. And I'm gonna share it with you. <laughs> so one of the first things that I found today was this little Barbie um, little ice cream truck. I believe that this is actually like the Wonder Nation or Kids Playset or whatever from like Walmart brand, but it's cute and it plays songs and Prim really likes it and it's got like some cute little designs in there and I mean it's missing some stickers or whatever. I'm not really sure how, there we go. I was like, I don't really know how that all works, but. Also she has a Barbie in there. It so was $2.99 you know, and so her big thing is Barbies. You can take that to her. And then she wanted to get Drew something, so she got him this little football. I love and it balls. actually was not ripped, but when he ripped the sticker off, it ripped it. And so, I don't know, it was a couple dollars. So there's that. So, shut the door behind you. So that is the stuff that I got. I am so, su shut the door behind I am like so super excited because I look like trash. Sorry, I had an appointment today. It was rough and I thought about doing like a little, little health update. Um, but anyway, um, I'm super excited because they had a Barbie dream house there and it was $25, it was like half corp or whatever. And she was like really interested in it. She was playing with it. She went and got Barbies from like the toy side and um, don't worry about Leo, his dad has him. He like was like super, super excited for the Barbie dream house. And that made me like super, super excited because we actually have a Barbie dream house for, for Christmas as her big gift. And so knowing, I think it was like the exact one, like this one was like half broken, missing the elevator, missing doors, like it was just a wreck. And it was, it would have been nice, you know, like I probably would have gotten it if I wouldn't have gotten the one for Christmas just cause it was like her thing. And she was like super, super happy about it. And she was playing with it and she loved it. And I am super happy to see that because yeah, I know for sure she's gonna love the dream house that we got her. But it's massive. I did not know how big they were. It's taller than her. So, yeah. Uh, but anyway, so there's that. This other thing that I found is so super cute. It is by Fisher Price, and it's just like this little cat. And so, like, you press the button and it sings. But if you. Um, and then, if you, like, press the head, like, the bottom goes. Oh. Okay, so I thought that was super cute for Leo. He's not quite old enough, but like I sat it like by him and he was like talking and cooing to it. And I just thought that it was a good little find and it's in really good condition and I can just swipe it down. And it was $2.99. So there's that. And then the rest is like clothing type items. If you get bored of that, it probably isn't for you. So that's what we're going on to. I have found a lot over the past couple few weeks, the last few trips that I went. I didn't get to go for a while because of our move. It hit like a little bit on the bank, but I did find some stuff. I got Drew this champion hoodie. I don't even know how much I paid, probably like $5. I literally took the tags off everything and then I was like, no, I want to film. But yeah, this champion hoodie, it was just nice and in his size. And so I grabbed it. I like to do that. And then I also grabbed him this old Navy um, jacket, which is in his size and it's nice. And I don't think he actually needs jackets, but I just have an issue with buying them. So I got that. And then Leo, I found this cute little um, Cardo shot of mine, like one piece. So it's like a pantsuit and it's super cute and it has like a little monkey and um it's a 12 months so it'll probably fit him by this winter because he's kind of going into like six to nine but anything that has like a full body is like nine months so um this cute little onesie i think it's adorable it is monsters inc i know nobody probably knows this if, if you've been around for years you would know um but like monsters inc is like my favorite like I think it's like my favorite Disney movie like ever. I love Monsters, Inc. Like, love it so much. So I was super excited to find this for him. And I just picked it up for him to wear. I found a couple of name brand shirts, which always make me super happy. Leo can fit into 12 month shirts. He's not even big like that. He's literally 26 inches and 14 pounds and 14 ounces. So he's not even big, but um, we have a little Nike shirt. And I have another one if I can find it. Yeah, so then I also found this one. So those are cute. 
Dakota, which is Leo's dad, is like a name brand junkie. He likes all of the kids to be dressed in name brand, but especially Leo and him. Um, and I, I usually find it on a pretty good deal at Goodwill. Uh, I'm not a name brand junkie like that. I do like it sometimes. I think it looks really, really good on the older kids for sure, but still. <laughs> so I got that. And then I found these separate, but I believe it's an outfit. So here's the little shorts and it's got little like animals on it. And then here's a shirt and it's got the same animals. So I think, like I'm pretty sure this is like actually an outfit. I had to buy them separate, but whatever. So, um, yeah. So I got that, and then I found Leo these little shorts. So these are just some little Nike shorts. Thought those were cute. Um, Prim, this shirt, she asked for it because it's um, LOL, so that's her thing. It's actually big, but she, whatever. I usually like, when I go to places like that, I don't mind to just buy them kind of stuff that they pick out because it is cheaper. Uh, usually anytime we go anywhere, they get to get something. I have very, very spoiled kids. So I do need to hurry this up though because we need to get to bed. It is almost time for bed. So then I got Leo this shirt, teacher tech support and this one and it just says keep on trucking and i got a lot of these because i like t-shirts on leo and he's outgrowing a lot of the ones that he has and so i just wanted to get some more and they had them my goodwill's been slacking the last few times i went for him this little one and this little one and then that's it for them and then um, well, that's it for their clothes. Sorry, I do have more, but that's it for their clothing. So my cousin is uh, having a girl and it's her third girl, but her first girl in nine years. And I had Prim five years ago. And so I was super excited to be able to buy some girl stuff. So I found this at Goodwill. <laughs> I got her this little Carter's nightgown. It just says love, it has a little bow. Nightgowns are my go-to. I buy them for people if I'm getting them clothes for their babies because yes, ma'am. And this is her, uh, this is her seventh, so she's <laughs> very well knowledge. This little onesie was too cute to pass up. Guys, I'm obsessed with lemons. Like, so stinking adorable. And she's due in January, so it'll be a little bit colder, so I didn't get to do summer stuff, but that's okay. And then I found this, which I thought was super adorable and it is a nightgown and then this is made into um, a headband like a little bow so cute and the last thing I found was just like this little like burp rag pillow cover and um, the animals on it melt my heart and the back is very very fuzzy and soft so yeah I grabbed those for her and I've got a couple pairs of shoes here they like this I don't know how they go, but I got them these shoes and I don't even know which foot they go on. So that'll be fun for me to figure out, but they were $3 and they're just, I don't know, they're cute. I actually don't like soft bottom shoes. I think soft bottom shoes are just cringy on babies. They're not meant to wear shoes. I try not to put on shoes because it like deforms feet and it's better for babies to not have shoes on. So I like to not put shoes and he's not even ready for shoes. He's never even worn a pair of shoes a day in his life because his feet are so stinking small. But I just thought these were cute because winter is coming up and he might fit in these by then. And I do want his shoes or his feet to be warm. So I got those. And then the other pair are these knockoff Vans. I don't like, I don't know what brand they are because, um, I don't know. Uh, I just can't find the brand. So. Walmart maybe, but yeah, I got these shoes for Queenie. I do have to put them up because they are a couple sizes too big, but they were $4 and they're in very, very good condition. Maybe worn a couple times. So I was super excited about those. And the last few things are a couple of bigger items. I found this towel today and I was like, I was pretty happy about this towel. Uh, a, it was only marked for $1.99, which was super fun. And it's also very cute and very Queenie. So it is, oh, if I can get it over here. It's an Elsa towel. <laughs> so it was only $2 and I like to have the kids, I like for them to have their own towels because then I can keep track and also they can just use their own towels when they're taking showers and then when they're hung up in there, we know, cause we don't wash towels every single time we shower. Um, we like, I'll use them a few times and like my towels and then like the kids can use their towels a couple of few times unless they get like dirty or something. Um, 
so I like to have their own towels for them to be able to for them to be able to um like keep up with it I guess do you know what I'm saying probably not so anyway I bought that because they don't have very many and then I bought two of these big like comforter set blankets for Leo I'm gonna have to stand up to show you guys but I got these because Leo lays on our living room floor and we have a rug but it's a nice rug and he spits up a lot and uh, so we don't want him to ruin our rug with spit up or drool. So we usually use blankets to put down, but then he's puking all over all of his blankets. And actually before it was his blankets, it was our blankets. So he was puking all over our blankets. And so I wanted specific blankets that were like just for the floor when he's down there rolling around. And I found these at Goodwill and I couldn't pass them up. I got one the other day and then I went again today and I found another one and... I was like, hell yeah, and then when he's older, these can double as just blankets for his crib. So I'm gonna stand up or like crouch back here to show you guys so you guys can see. A um, Lion King one, super cute. And then this one I actually like better. It's like just like little, little animals. So yeah, these are adorable. These little animals are super cute. And they are like perfectly sized for him for our living room floor. And he won't be puking on our blankets anymore. I mean, we won't have as much laundry um, because I mean, he can spit up on those a few times before I have to wash them. We live in an apartment complex. And so our laundry is in the main building here, which is like phew, that way. And you can't drive to it because that, I mean, the parking lot is like, anyway, we have to walk down there and after walker laundry so laundry is not fun but if you guys enjoyed this good haul and you want no and you want to see more um give me a thumbs up so that i know that you guys enjoyed subscribe comment to keep the youtube algorithm going i work really hard on my channel that was once really big and has died down and i basically am at the point where i just have like loyal followers but i am a mom of three and i have health issues and a lot of doctor's appointments between us and so uh, I do put a lot of work into the channel, even though I'm not your big high-end YouTuber. I would absolutely love it if you would take the time to um, just watch my content. And if it's something that you like, stick around because I just, I'm not, I'm not your Hollywood YouTuber. I don't have a lot of money. I don't live in a mansion. I don't drive a super nice car. I'm just a mom of three who's trying to make it. And I like to share a lot of it with you guys. So with that being said, don't forget to have a terrific day.